calling all Lego lovers. The Art of Brick has created a space for you. It's an interactive museum of creative art pieces made completely of Legos. They feature some classics like the Mona Lisa. Alexis Frazier went to check it out and has this morning's fresh report. All right, guys. Well, some of the things that this artist created will truly amaze you. More than one million Lego pieces were used to create the Art of the Brick. Art like you've never seen it, made completely out of a children's toy, Legos. You know, Lego is the most popular toy in the world. Being able to use it as an art medium is something very unique. I can, I can use this toy to make something that expresses emotion, and then people get hopefully inspired by that artwork, and yet they also connect with it, they can relate to it, because it's out of a toy we're all so familiar with. Nathan Sawaya was a lawyer who changed careers after realizing what he can create out of these. Inside one of the first rooms of this tour, he used 80,000 Lego bricks to make this 20-foot-long Tyrannosaurus Rex skeleton. Each room has something special and unique for you to enjoy, like the pink dream room, which is made of 102,000 Lego bricks. If you're looking for a photo op, the pink room is the perfect place to take full advantage of it. They have a pink and white ice cream cone that you can't miss, and of course, the chair. That's a, a nice place to enjoy because they can sit uh, in, in the chair that we have there, made, of course, out of Legos. They can take pictures and they really have fun in there. Some of this artwork was so captivating, Lady Gaga asked to use the yellow sculpture in her video. It's a life-size representation of a man pulling his chest apart with yellow Lego bricks flowing from the cavity. There are more than 150 creative sculptures, and one that's relatable to South Florida is the swimmer, which is made of more than 10,000 bricks. Dang, girl, you ain't never gonna come up for air. And if you can't book that trip to Paris, the Mona Lisa has come to you, the Lego version, that is. After being surrounded by so much inspiration, kids can come to the Lego build area and create their own works of art. They are going to have a lot of fun. Plus, this is something that they can enjoy together, the family. Well, the Art of the Brick is open right now. For ticket information and times, just head to our website, local10.com. And I was like, you know, I need to step my game up because I'm not really great at Legos, but what he was able to create is amazing. I know you have, like, an artistic child who can, like, create <laughs> well, everything. Well, no, I mean, but the, right. the, all, all kids love Legos. Yes, we, absolutely We know right. that, but we never really think about our kids making a profession out of it, that's for sure. I mean, he's, no. he's got a special skill. Not Seriously. anybody can just walk in and do that. <laughs> you got it? You, you can do something like that? Not, not like that, okay, no. Okay. You know, and we enjoy, and both of us enjoy seeing our children create and, mm -hmm. you know, build these ideas mm -hmm. out of nothing, but that is next level. Yeah. Good yeah, stuff. they told me that when children come and play in that Lego Pit. I don't know if you guys did that. Yes. That one kid built like Mario. So some of them get really, really creative. Great. This is like a children's paradise, or I guess a Lego lover's paradise. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't have to be for children. We, well, we, I loved it. Yeah. I thought it was great. So yeah. awesome. go check it out. Yeah. Right, let's check on our Friday forecast. Brandon has.